Talented, hardworking, dedicated. These are just a few words used to describe FSU's senior defensive tackles, Fred Jones and Demarcus Christmas. As two of the most experienced athletes on the team, both are recognized for their on-field abilities and success. They should have set the example, um, the standard of what Florida State football should be in and what they thought it should be when they came here. They want to leave a legacy here, um, being one of the better senior classes that came through here and uh, wanted them to take pride in it. Fred and uh, Christmas took me under their wing and really taught me a lot by playing defensive tackle and especially getting used to uh, the intensity of Odell. Those guys really stayed in my ear and really just kept me motivated, kept me going. Known for their serious work in the trenches, Fred and Demarcus are also known for their humorous personalities off the field. Whenever I see Fred on the building, he's always cool. He's always, I think there hasn't been a week that's gone by where he's like, he's like, oh, game two, only eight more, only 10 more, and gives me a hug. So like that, because we're seniors, it's pretty funny. My favorite memory of Demarcus is the Florida game when his Achilles started hurting. Um, <laughs> I don't, I'm not going to make fun of him and make the noise that he made, but just know that uh, we still joke about it to this day. Despite the joy, excitement, and camaraderie that come with playing football, the road to becoming the athletes they are today wasn't always an easy one. Overcame a lot, overcame um, a knee injury back in high school, overcame a uh, um, near-death experience in high school also. Um, and, you know, when you face adversity, you just got to face it head on. The day after Coach Odell called me, I'm just laying there in bed. I'm mad at the world. And he, just, he called me and told me to come over. And I talked to him. I talked to him for, like, hours. And he's just giving me motivation. And then guys, I came in and they said, Christmas, take advantage of your injury. It's times like these, when it's not easy for Fred and DeMarcus to stand on their own, that they turn to their teammates, coaches, and loved ones for support. So like my parents, my sisters, friends, families, um, teammates, they know what I was going through, but um, not one time did they ever like really gave up on me. So like having th that big support system is what kept me going through everything I went through. My mom, Coach Odell, the players, my e e from every position, it all just motivated me to, be, to work on things that I couldn't work on, like physically when I was hurt. People always talk about being a great player, but sometimes you got to push that aside, being a great coach. You got to push that aside. You got to be a great person before you can do that. You got to be selfless. And with role models like these, inspiring them to be the best they can be, Fred and Demarcus have high hopes for the future. In a few years, I hopefully be in the NFL, but if not, I want to get into um, a little bit of business, entrepreneurship, um, when I'm about 40, 45, somewhere in that ball range. I kind of want to um, build a school and like, you know, run the school. If not the NFL, I really want to be working with like kids, like troubled kids, just like give them advice. Cause I had, I had that growing up and I could have went left easily, but I, I went, I took the right path and I just want to be somebody that they can come talk to or anything like that and as they make way for a new generation of seminal football. These soon-to-be college graduates hope to be remembered for more than just being great players. They hope to be remembered as great teammates and even better human beings. Christmas came in, we all knew coming in he was gonna be that, that guy. And I think when he leaves here, people are gonna remember him as a guy that worked hard and was a, was a baller. I just wanna show them that I'm very hardworking when adverse situations come up, um, I can handle them with ease. Just really want to let everybody know that I'm hardworking. Fred Jones, you know, now he, he didn't want to be remembered as, you know, a legacy player. He wanted to make his own name here at Florida State. I want to be remembered as somebody who was a great person, great character, hard worker, but I never just want to be remembered as just a football player. I would just say, you know, don't think like you're just a football player. I, I tell them all the time, just, you're not just a football player, you are, you're a person. And as they move on to the next chapter of their lives, Fred Jones and Demarcus Christmas will always hold dear 
their time at FSU. With so much potential in football and in life, there's nowhere to go but up for these two talented athletes. I'm Jessica Pastor for Seminole Sports Magazine.